What's going on guys, it's Brandon here. I just want to make a quick little video. I know I haven't made one in a pretty long time, ever since that response to Alkin on religion. But, um, I have been doing a ton, and I, I do mean quite a few uh, skills lately. I mean, it's only really been two, maybe, I guess three skills. But uh, I have made some decent progress on one. You can probably check just by my cash tag. I went from like 50 something mil, or 60 mil maybe, to 15 Plus, I do have my D pick, but that's a different story. Um, but yeah, I've been losing a lot of money lately, but for a good reason. I don't know if you guys have noticed, or if any of you really knew, because I never really told anyone other than a few people that I talk to regularly, and in the French I'm in, X Slayer X85. Um, oh, he changed his name back, nice. So, um, yeah, I'm in that French chat a lot. I've been telling some of them, and uh, since my total level has been pretty stationary for the last few weeks, or even probably a month it hasn't really gone up other than dungeoneering because a lot of the stuff i was training was stuff i already had 99 and you know i got a few mining levels here and there i got myself up to 89 but uh, i decided that i do want to go for a max cape and you know i want to start off slow so i don't get too ridiculously bored with it because i think that's what happened uh to me before and i'm sure that happens to a lot of people you set a goal something that high and yeah you really want to work for it and you want to keep doing it but it, if you spend so much time going from one goal then it, you might get bored and that is never good when it comes to runescape because then you won't be getting xp you won't be doing things as efficiently as you can so uh, my current goal that i decided to set for myself is to get level 90 in all of my skills that may seem like it is really hard to do, but if you guys have been uh, have checked my stats recently, um, yeah, I'm getting there. Let's just put it that way. So, uh, I wanted you guys to tell me if you would want to see like a road. To, it, it'll be called Road to Max Cape, and I'll start at episode one. I won't continue anything I had before. I'll start at episode one, uh, hopefully soon. But it depends because I did forget to record uh, my levels that I got over the last few days, but. If you guys would want to see a road to max cape thing, then let me know. But for now, it's just going to be working on getting everything to level 90. I'm not going to be like grinding one skill for a really long time getting it to 99. It's going to be focusing on getting everything level 90 right now. And if you guys would want to see that as a video series of something I can do weekly or bi-weekly so it's more videos for you guys to watch, then let me know because it's something I'm, with, I, I'm going to be working towards on RuneScape anyway. So if it's something that you guys would want to see me record and kind of just be able to show you guys my progress in it then do you know let me know because i will be able to do that for you so since i did forget to record the levels i thought i would show you guys exactly what i've done in the last more or less two or three days so um let me just check okay, farm run in 12 minutes so basically uh i spent 40 or 41 mil i think on construction and i was able to get 90 construction uh, that only took me like two days. I made mahogany tables, and with 90 construction came 2,400 total, uh, which was one of my goals for a long time. I've been like 2,380 and 2,390 something for the longest time, so uh, finally breaking 2,400 was pretty pretty nice. Uh, so I went 82 to 90 construction in like three days, and then I did uh, what else did I? Oh yeah, I got a few mining levels. I don't know if I was 89 in the last video. I know I did go 87 to 89 so far down here. And I'm going to be staying to uh, 90 down here, so hopefully be able to get that in the next few days. I am still, like, just barely scratching the surface on the level 463k to 90, so I got 89 mining, and I also got one crafting level along with 99 fletching. I don't think I mentioned any of those before, but in case I did, I apologize. I don't remember those, so for my 90 plus goal, uh, there's not a whole lot left, to be honest. Um, with the rune span update coming hopefully next week. Uh, that means that the new rune crafting method is going to be coming along and hopefully, well, they already confirmed that it's going to be better XP than ZMI. So I think for a while I'm just going to, uh, I know I said I'm not going to grind, but I'm probably going to grind out rune crafting and go for 90. I'm 2.8 mil off and 82. So hopefully be able to get that slowly. And uh, yeah, I'm really not too far away from my first goal of all 90 plus. All I need now is uh, rune crafting, agility, crafting and mining and i calculated it yesterday and on green dehyde bodies especially if i get 90 mining first and sell my d pick i will be able to afford 90 crafting if i buy and sell in 
I think it's like 10k uh, green D leather at a time. That way, because I, I obviously can't afford to buy like all that I need at once. So I'll buy, uh, yesterday I bought 7,500 uh, green D leather. I made uh, 2,500 green D had bodies, which got me to 87 and then halfway to 88. So I think I'm going to, uh, well, I've been working on farming too, but that's already 90 plus. I should be able to get most of the way to 99, but I might be stuck at 98. So basically what I'm going to be doing for the next few days to a week, I want to say, is um, I'm going to be mining, hopefully to get 90 mining as soon as possible. That way I can sell my D pick, and then once I get that, or in between, like if I get bored of mining and I just don't want to do it, like I'm not going to keep myself doing something that I don't want to do, because then I'm going to get bored and I'm not going to stay focused on my goal. So if I get really bored of mining or something, uh, I will go buy some crafting with the money I have left. I know I don't have a lot, but it's enough to buy a decent amount at a time since you do uh, make some of the money back by selling it um, as the dehyde bodies. You buy the D leather, you you do lose money. I'm not exactly sure the GP per XP at this point, but you do lose money, and you always will probably lose money. But um, I will be spending most of my money buying that. And then once I'm able to finish up mining and sell my D-Pick, that means I will be able to afford more mining at a time because after, or, well, I'll be able to afford, afford more crafting at a time, sorry, because after 90 mining and I sell my D-Pick for a while, um, um, I'll buy 80, 80, wow, what am I saying? I'm 87 crafting now. I'll buy 90 crafting after I sell my D-Pick. And after that, after crafting and mining, well, after just crafting at this point, I'm done all my viables to 90 plus. So uh, all I'd have left is rune crafting and agility after I finish up these two, which won't really take long at all. I could do crafting in a few days, and same with mining. So if I just finish this ASAP, then uh, the only two skills I have left are just basically finding the time for me to do it. I, I mean, they're not fun, but they're not viable. So. Uh, I'm not. I'm probably not going to make a whole lot of money from what I heard about Rune Span, but um, you know, hopefully, I will be able to make some. So before I ramble on too much, I think I'm going to end the video there. Just be sure to comment on the video and uh, give it a thumbs up if you think that I should make a series on the road to Max Cape and uh, basically document my pro progress. If that's something you would want to see, like I said, comment and thumbs up the video so I know. And if I get enough thumbs up and comments, then I can start hopefully next week. So thanks for watching guys and I'll see you in the next few days with uh, another video.